All right, thank you. You get a half for free now if you want to. <laughs> okay, cool. The golf hat over there. Cypress. All right, folks, welcome back. It is 6.55 in the morning. We are up early and excited yeah. because we are going to a community garage sale that we went to last year, and we found a ton of golf clubs and a bunch of fishing stuff, yeah. so I'm definitely excited about it, and Ashley is cooking up some breakfast. Can't shop hangry. No, what are we can. having? Eggs and toast. Breakfast champions. Actually, it's just the easiest thing. Yeah. Not very exciting. That wasn't as exciting. We could have just done our normal intro in the car, but we'll meet you there. At garage sale number one. <laughs> How much are the uh, golf clubs? Alan? Selling uh, golf clubs? <laughs> about uh, eight bucks, two dollars a iron. Eight bucks? Yeah. Cool, I can do that. Oh, you got the. You? Yeah. Nice. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate Appreciate yep. You. Got a Cleveland 588 56 degree wedge and then a, a couple of uh, rack OS's with uh, graphite shafts and all the grips are really good too. Pretty good deal. Eight bucks. Yeah. Yeah. Got some Tourage irons, Hawkeye uh, driver, Hawkeye VFT. Adam's driver. Air assault. Air assault. A friend of mine dropped them off. Oh, uh, okay. What did he say, hon? $100 for the whole thing? That's the only way he wants to sell it? He said $150 or best offer. $150 or best offer? Tons of records. <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, I went and priced everything because records are worth more than a buck, but Mary yeah. Manilow's are only worth 50 cents. Did you have any golf clubs for sale? Golf clubs. Oh, okay. I got rid of them a long time ago. <laughs> I got a bad shoulder injury and I can't do that. Oh, uh, yeah. But there is somebody up Okay, cool. Thank you. Somebody, somebody <laughs> we got a hot tip on some golf clubs. The guy by the parking lot is selling them out of his car. That sounds sketchy. <laughs> I knew they turned. Probably the best hybrid. <laughs> yeah, they figured if it was something good, yeah, they wouldn't. So. That's right. That's yeah. exactly what happened. Exactly. Yeah. Oh, it was a ping scasto cover. Yeah, <laughs> ping zing too. <laughs> Full set of Adams. Nice. Oh, some Yonex. We saw the uh, the new Yonex blades at the uh, PJ Merchandise show last year. Those things were so nice. We got a hammer driver. Is 
that's the hammer, by the way. Yeah. Oh, look at, you got look yeah, I've seen them before. Brand They're new. funny. <laughs> brand new. Very good. Have you seen the red one with the uh, the holes in it? No. <laughs> crazy. Yeah, that one's pretty crazy too. That's all the good ones were in that bag. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Did you have the putter that goes with that guy? I wish. <laughs> yeah. Well, I got one that's just probably just as just as valuable. The Wilson, yeah, 8802. 80 yeah. yeah. Probably yeah, the grip. Yeah. yeah. How much do you want for that? It's probably 30 bucks. 30 bucks, cool. That's, a, that's an odd one there. Here's a good part yeah. here, though. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, two ball? Can't go wrong with two ball. Yeah. <laughs> two ball, 8813, that's old school there. Mm hmm. George Low Wizard. <laughs> I haven't seen that one. No. That's the one that uh, Jack Nicholas used to win all those tournaments. Oh, really? Huh. Not, the, not his, that. <laughs> 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 That's probably in somebody's Hall of Fame. Yeah. It's probably in the actual Hall of Fame. <laughs> I wouldn't be surprised, yeah. There's a, there's a ping in there. There's a ping. Kind of an unusual one. Ping. A blade? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah, A blade. But I haven't. What is that? The 5BZ? Huh. Yeah. I haven't seen that. No. Yeah. Soak that in Coca Cola and come back to friends. <laughs> The grip. <coughs> These are the new grips. So. Mm -hmm. There's a couple of wedges there. Uh huh. Let's see, I got one, two. I think I'm going to get the Wilson 8802 too. Okay. Cool. So I got four, I think. These are the only two that you said 30 on that. Yeah. And then this one didn't have a price on it. Yeah, about 20. 20. 50. 75. And then this one had a price tag. It was 15 somewhere. Cool. So we got, what's the total now? <laughs> 15. So that's 40, 60, 70. Cool. That's fine. Okay. I got a 10. You got a 10? Yeah. Zing, zing. I don't know why I switched hands. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, thank yeah. you. You get a half for free now if you want to. <laughs> okay, cool. There's a golf hat over there. Cypher Steers, I don't know if you're familiar with that. Yep, that's where we play. <laughs> <laughs> thank you. Alright, no problem. <laughs> hybrids, I got hybrids. You're a hybrid man. I got a bunch of those. Yeah, okay. You can never figure out which one I like. I, I could keep them. buying more of them. I got the new. Okay, bud. I got the new uh, B21 Callaway. Mm hmm. You like that? I just ordered the new Callaway Epic Max. Oh, yeah. Ones. Yeah, the new ones. They won't be here until the 15th of this month. Yeah. I got, you ever go to Moon Golf in Melbourne? No, I haven't been down there. Yeah, that's, if you're going to buy golf clubs. That's a good spot. They are great on trade ins, you know, at Dick's. By the, at yeah, Dick's. they give you $5 and for you a Scotty Cameron. You go to, well, you buy it from them for three hundred dollars and take it back a week later they offer you a hundred dollars mm -hmm. the moon golf is very good man. okay and Dan moon he'll wheel and deal with you you know so i take stuff down all the time but, yeah you know. beats uh, messing with ebay nah, I don't know. <laughs> yeah <laughs> all right buddy have a good one Thank you. yep you too oh you don't want to buy a set of or I like the Yonex ones, but I got a deal. <laughs> uh, they're mine. Oh really? Yeah. How much did you two, want for the Yonex? Two through, two through attack, and I had the nines, the nine and the five though. They had the, these replaced at Yonex. I mean, they, had, they put it in so they matched them up. You know? Uh huh. So anyway, uh, I, I was going eighty bucks for the whole set for the irons. I already blew my budget on these ones. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right. No. <laughs> Thank you, That's though. Okay. That's, uh, we work together. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Thank you. This is all I got to sell. Though. That's oh yeah. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Have a good one. Oh, a Geo Pro for sale. Is this a 16 then? Yeah. Also, guys, look forward to a uh, let's go buy an RV video soon. Oh, oh it's the 19. Come on in. I'll give you the grand. <laughs> okay.
This Ooh. is a Murphy bed. Oh, nice. And then the couch is here. I'll show you how easy it works. Okay. Yeah, we've looked at a 14 one of these, but it's a little bit too small. This one looks way nicer. What's nice about this is that, you know, you pull in somewhere and you're like pull into like Cracker Barrel or Walmart or something like that. Mm -hmm. You don't have slide outs to worry about. Yeah. Anything. This has a, a brand new gr grill we've never even used. <laughs> okay. We haven't even used a shower in there actually. <laughs> Not that we don't take showers. <laughs> For the campground or something. Yeah, it's just easier. But it has the full, uh, has a 100 watt solar on top. Okay. Yeah, it's already pre-wired. Oh, no, it's on there. Okay. Yeah. It's there and it has a thousand watt inverter. That's what this little button is over here. So. If you're boondocking or something, mm -hmm. you can you can make like a you know coffee and stuff. You know, yeah, it won't do the microwave. Okay. Gas and electric. Okay. You can take a look at the okay. bathroom. Does that propane? It has two twenty-gallon propane tanks. Okay. On the front and two batteries. Oh, okay. So with the hundred watts of solar, you're in good shape. Mm-hmm. That thing is so nice. It's ridiculous. The bathroom is crazy. Ooh, you've been in the 14 one. Yeah. Yeah, those are super really nice. It's just obviously it's a lot smaller. Yeah. So they don't have the flexibility. I think the 16 would be perfect. That's the 19. And then we've been in the 14. The 16 would be perfect. Yeah. In between. Yeah. Because I think it still has that nice bathroom in the back, but the, the Murphy bed kind of looks like takes up a lot of space. Yeah. In terms of like the amount of space it takes to put it in there. Uh-huh. That's the thing that's like I've heard most annoying about tribal trailers though is converting the couch into the bed. That's nice that all you have to do is just Yeah, flip it up, flip it down. You don't have to like yeah. make the bed to Every eat lunch. Time. Yeah. <laughs> exactly. All right, folks, we just got done testing everything out right before it rained. Now we are stationed under the tree, but let's take a look at everything that we got. Also, I uh, just got uh, done editing the garage sale portion of it, and that last guy, he was so nice, and uh, we ended up ripping him off unintentionally. Yeah. I was like adding the things up in my head and I got confused and I added it up to be 70 but it was definitely 90 so we're gonna uh, he said the uh, place that he normally goes and buys clubs is uh, moon golf in Melbourne so we're gonna call them up on Monday and uh, see if we can't he knows who he is and we'll give him like a uh, $20 uh, gift card just sitting there waiting for him yeah, exactly. That'd be pretty cool. but uh, yeah that was definitely my bet and he was super nice he gave us like ridiculously good prices on everything I felt super bad I think he thought we were, like I was watching it back, I think he thought we were negotiating. Yeah. I was like, I like stopped at 70 and it kind of like sounded like, uh, I was like, 70 yeah, is good enough. Question mark. No, I was literally just trying to add it up. If you watch the channel, I'm terrible at uh, math. And uh, Yeah, and I didn't know the prices, so I couldn't help. Yeah, so. the, the prices were all uh, faced away from her, but we'll definitely try and make it up to him. And he knows where we play. Uh, he knows where we play. We uh, just... Uh, we got the free hat and I told him that's where we played. Yeah, but let's take a look at everything. <laughs> and uh, also, guys, comment below if we should get the uh, RV. But let's take a look at everything really quick. <laughs> we got the uh, Callaway Rogue 4-wood with a, a Stiff Flex Chef. That thing was only $15. That's crazy. That was a crazy deal. And then we got the Scotty Cameron Art of Putting <laughs> head cover. That thing alone is worth like $35 or $40. And then the Wilson 8802 with a brand new grip. And it's still got the original, well, not the original, but the uh, where he bought it probably $120. And he gave it to us for $30. So. Yeah. And it felt fantastic. Yeah, it felt amazing. Ashley uh, made a few putts with it, and I'll play myself uh, missing a few putts with it. <laughs> but uh, speaking of making stuff, I chipped one in with the uh, Titleist uh, SM6 Vokey Wedge, the F grind. These things are super nice, and this one is in perfect condition. Look yeah, at that. I can't believe that finish holding up like that. Yeah, I think that was 20. That's what threw me off. I was like trying to like, well, nothing, it doesn't take much to throw me off. And then at the uh, first sale, we got the uh, TaylorMade racks and the uh, Cleveland 588s, absolute classic. And then there was also this weird like night approach wedge in there. And then a personal grail of mine, the uh, Ping Answer Redwood. This is like the one of the first, uh, not the first, but like uh, they don't usually mill putters. And then this is a, their classic answer style, but it's milled. Usually their stuff is cast, so it has a little bit harsher of a feel, but this one milled money Ashley made a putt with it so <laughs> that doesn't really tell you anything but uh felt really great. <laughs> yeah but I uh, hope you guys did like this video if you did hit the like button and subscribe and we'll see, you next time. see you next time guys also comment below if we should uh, get the uh, the RV or if you know who that guy is yeah exactly yeah or if he's watching this he can email us and we will send him $20 yeah. we will send him more than $20 I feel really bad he was so nice but he was cool with us afterwards he called his buddy and then he gave oh, us a yeah. free hat I think and he started he chatting us up Negotiate. Yeah, I think he just thought that was like the weirdest negotiation move ever. Just like stop counting <laughs> and see if the guy says yes. 
Maybe we'll have to try it next time. Yeah, maybe that'll be a key <laughs> negotiating. But his prices were so good, I didn't even try and negotiate. But uh, whatever. Hope you guys like this video. If you did, hit the like button, subscribe, and yeah, we'll see you next time. Yeah, it's uh, lightning and thundering. Let's stop holding metal objects. Thank you very much.